hello guys, uh, I've started to play Minecraft again, as you might see with the Doom tutorial, if you watched it. But yeah, um, basically I'm playing the pre-release, it's pre-release number 2 now, so 1.9.2 I think, pre-release, or maybe it's just 1.9 and then pre-release pre 2, yeah whatever. But they've changed the server properties since I last played, as I played like 1.6 I think, then I didn't play anymore. Basically I'm gonna go through this. So. We're gonna start with uh, the first thing that is different: difficulty. And uh, yeah, no wait. Let's let's take everything by itself. Level name is basically it will if you don't have a world, it will create a world with that name. If you change it, you will create another world, and then you can easily change from different worlds by just changing it here without you know, like renaming the folder and stuff like that. Allow Nether Nether world. If you don't know what that is, Google it. It's like a hell world, and uh, it. I don't have it because I don't see the point. Maybe I add it later on when my 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 users on my server have gotten a little more stuff, so we can go and raid in the little hell world. Spawn monsters, spawn creepers, zombies, some spiders, some like stuff like that. Online mode. If you want it uh, to be cracked, you put it to false. And also, if you want it to be on uh, local area network, you put it to false. I think. And the online mode, you, it checks the connection of the guys who tries to join your server. If they aren't logged in, they cannot join your server. So basically I have it to false because I myself haven't bought Minecraft, I have it cracked. Difficulty, this is a new thing for me. So we have three difficulties at the moment, I think. And these are the difficulties, I think. Uh, oh, sorry, easy. Okay, so I have difficulty in one, which means normal. Uh, basically, EC creepers and stuff have uh, creepers uh, takes longer to explode. If you move away from them, they will also uh, stop their exploding process and start to move towards you again. So you can easily kill them without getting the explosion. Uh, zombies have lower damage and stuff like that. You cannot uh, die from hunger. Y your if you do not eat, your health bar will go to five health. And then it will stay there. It will not go further than five health. Uh, yeah, normal. Uh, you you also have higher damage. I think normal. You have a normal damage. Uh, zombies have normal damage. Creepers are normal, and everything is normal. You do not die from not eating though, but you go to a half heart, half health. Uh, yeah, hard mode. You can die from starvation if you do not eat. You will die. Uh, Creepers and stuff explode faster and things like that. More damage, you deal less damage, stuff like that. Game mode, this is also funny. If you want a normal server where people come in, they craft, they craft for their own material, stuff like that, you put it to zero. I want that too. Uh, game mode is basically either survival mode or creative mode. In creative mode, you have all the items you need. If you, you they do not, you have an infinite amount of them. Uh, you can fly. If you hit one block one time, it will disappear. So you can easily craft things. No, not craft. You can easily build buildings and stuff like that. But I have it to zero. But you can easily change this from one player to the other. Uh, sorry. So yeah. If you're OP, you can just type like this in game. Game mode. Then the the name of the player that you want to change the game mode of. And then uh, game mode one or zero. Uh, game mode one means survive, uh, creative. Zero is survival. So if you want to give someone creative mode, you type in uh, one. But if you then want to change it back, you change that to zero. Yeah. Uh, this won't work now. But if you want to, in the console, you can just type game mode for room without a slash, because slash doesn't work here. Uh, one. And I already have game mode one, yeah, because I'm building stuff right now. So yeah. Uh, but yeah. So this is basically when people join the server, they automatically have this game mode. If you do not change it, they will also ha still have this game mode. But you can change the game mode for players later on. Okay, spawn animals. Easy, it spawns animals, stuff like that. Max players. I have 20 max, doesn't really matter. Server IP, don't put it in, it will all, it will fuck up your server. P 
PvP, if you want players to be able to hurt each other, I think it's quite fun to go around with a bow and shoot people. Level C, they don't mind that if you don't know what it is. I cannot really, uh, I can explain it. It's basically, people can create seeds of level. Uh, it's basically, it's uh, you decide how the level this it will look like when you first create your server. By a seed. I don't know. Server port. Yeah, uh, well, you can change it, but the thing is, I did, and um, I changed it to another port. I have it everything open, but still players can connect to my server. So basically, don't change the port. It will fuck things up. A lot of flight. Basically, if you want people to be able to fly, I have it in yes because I don't get why. They will still die from falling on the ground and stuff like that. Whitelist. If you want players, if you want to like create a here in in here, I mean. A list of players that will be able to reconnect now. Toru will be able to connect for Roy, but everyone else will be denied to connect. Yeah, same. Uh, and mode, I don't really know how to open it, I don't really know how to see it, but I have server of Le Toru. So, yeah. So, yeah, that's basically that's it. Uh, yeah, thank you for watching this video, I hope it helped.